guys, I just wanted to come on here and make this quick video. Um, I was looking online, and shout out to Food and Fashion Sense. She's the one who um, made me really think about this rebate deal. And the rebate deal I'm talking about is this um, spend 50, get $15 from Procter & Gamble. Now, she was talking about how the Pantene shampoos, which are which count toward this spend 50, get 15, are $7 this week at Rite Aid. Um, and when you buy two, it's two for seven dollars, and then you get back a two dollar up reward when you buy two, making it two for five. And there's this three dollar off two coupon that came out this past Sunday, the 26th, which makes it two for two dollars. But you get the entire uh, seven dollars toward the spend 50, get 15. So the limit on this deal per card is two. I plan on doing this deal four times on two different cards, getting me up to $28, but I won't really spend anything out of pocket because I'm going to pay with up rewards. So the only thing I'm going to spend is tax. So that takes care of more than half of that rebate, okay, in $28. So then I was looking through my Safeway ad, and I noticed that there's a few deals this week, okay? The first one is um, spend 75, get 10. So if you don't have a Safeway, um, maybe if you have an affiliate, you'll also have this going on. If not, check in your paper today because people in Idaho are saying that they're getting a $10 off, $75 worth of groceries coupon in their paper. So you might get one of those instead of this Catalina deal. Anyway, this Catalina deal runs from the 2nd through the 5th, so Friday through Monday of this coming week and the following week, Friday through Monday. And when you spend $75, you get $10 back in a Catalina for your next shopping trip. Okay, and the other deal um, that I thought was pretty good... I can find the ad. Sorry, you know my boys, they love to touch every little paper. Okay, so the deal after that is spend $10 on frozen, it says on any frozen products and get a $5 coupon in for the freezer section on any of these new products. You can use that $5 coupon. Okay, so it's like, oh, that's a pretty awesome deal, right? Because you can actually combine this spend 10 get five and that spend 75 get 10 deal because it doesn't exclude frozen products so I thought that that was a great deal now on top of that if any of you guys remember that General Mills rebate um, that I was talking about which is only available at um, Safeway locations and their affiliates um, I have not done this deal yet but you have to make your purchases by March 31st and then have it mailed in by the 14th Okay, and so basically you buy 10 of these items, you can buy all 10, you don't have to buy all 10, but you can buy 10 of these items and you'll get reimbursed up to these amounts. So as long as you're buying one and it's under this price, you will get the rebate, okay? So that's pretty cool because when I tallied it up, this was actually more than $30 worth of groceries and all of these items will count toward that spend 75, get 10, okay? And so I figured I'm going to do this rebate deal this week while they're offering that spend 75, get 10, because I'll get all those items back for free. Sorry, you can't see my face. That was awkward. Okay, so that takes care of the Pantene. Um, the Pantene deal um, that I saw at Safeway um, is they are $3.49 at Safeway. There's an in ad coupon, and the limit on that is actually four so you can buy four per transaction to get them for this three 49 piece but you have to spend 75 all at once to get that ten dollar catalina anyway um so it's 349 with this in-app coupon and you can again use these three dollar coupons right here so you'll get four for just under fourteen dollars and then you can use two of these to bring that out of pocket cost down but the spend 75 is before manufacturers coupons so you can use these and you'll still get the full value of just under $14 toward the spend 75 get 10 which is a great deal okay and remember I told you guys about that um, spend $10 on frozen food and get $5 back well this week at Safeway they have their frozen um, eating right or Safeway select meals on sale for $1.79 and the limit on those is six per transaction and if you buy all six that will bring you to just 
to 1074 so you're just over that spend 10 get five deal so that's a pretty good deal right there okay and the Kellogg cereals are also on sale this week um, two, uh, four for ten dollars so they're 250 a piece and there's a Kellogg rebate where you buy 10 participating Kellogg cereals now they aren't really the fun cereals they're kind of the boring ones on the rebate like Raisin Bran, um, I don't really like stuff in my cereal. All brands, Smart Start Corn Flakes, um, not the frosted ones, just the plain ones. Raisin Bran, Crispix, um, Product 19, Cracklin, Low Fat Granola with Raisins, and Rice Krispies. Okay, so those are basically the ones included. And I will buy the Rice Krispies because we like to make Rice Krispie treats. All right, so you can buy those four for 10, and this will count also toward the spend 75, get 10 deal, okay? And then once you get 10 of the participating Kellogg cereals, you can submit for this, this uh, $10 rebate, uh, not $10 rebate, yeah, it is a $10 rebate, but it's a gas card. So you basically have to buy 10 participating cereals, you have to submit your UPCs and this completed form, and then they mail you a $10 gas card. Awesome, awesome deal. So this is what I decided I'm gonna do, and like I said, those $75 are before coupons. So the two Safeway deals, just to recap quickly, are spend $75 on participating products. Um, products that are not included include gift cards, um, phone cards, um, anything in the refrigerated dairy section like milk, cheese, butter, I believe all that stuff is out. Um, as far as the frozen foods, I know that you... As far as the frozen food deal, which is spend 10, get 5, I know you can't buy, like, frozen seafood, frozen meat, anything frozen in the deli department. All that stuff says is excluded. But those Safeway meals are included. It doesn't say that those are out. So here's what I plan on buying. I plan on buying four Pantene um, shampoos. That'll be $13.96 and using two of those coupons. All right, I'm going to do the entire General Mills rebate. So I'm going to buy all 10 of these products which includes the multi-grain peanut butter Cheerios, the Dolce de Leche Cheerios, the Nature Valley Protein Bars, um, the Fruit Flavored Snacks by Ocean Spray, Betty Crocker Fundamentals, Cake Mix, well it's a cupcake actually, Progresso Rich and Hearty Soup, Pillsbury Grand's Biscuit Sandwiches or Egg Scrambles, Totino's Pizza Stuffers, Yoplait Greek 4-Pack or the and the Yoplait Greek with Granola 4-Pack. Okay, and that is um, going to bring me to... $38.91 for just these items. So not including the Pantene, just these 10 items would be $38.91. And that's an estimate based on what the sale prices were this week. It might be higher, it might be lower. Um, I'm not quite sure about that. And then the four Kellogg cereals, they're four for 10. Um, and we have this $4 off four coupon that was available on coupons.com. This is only for certain varieties of Kellogg cereals. And I plan on buying the Rice Krispies because the Rice Krispies are included they're included in the sale and they're included on the rebate form okay and then I also have all these coupons for the items on the the general mills rebate form okay so that's going to bring my out-of-pocket down and I have a one dollar Catalina that I got um, last week from buying Gerber I don't know what it was that I bought that was Gerber but they gave me a one dollar Catalina and then I have this one for the Propresso soup also buy four I plan on buying four cans that's why my General Mills is so high because I plan on buying four cans but I will only get reimbursed for one can okay not all four and then I'm also going to buy the six Safeway meals which are the ones that are $1.79 with the in-app coupon okay and th those were a total of $10.74. And that leaves me just shy of about $4. So I'm going to buy one of the Arrowhead 24-pack waters. They're on sale for $3.99. I always like to keep water on hand just in case of emergencies. So I will gladly buy this Arrowhead 24-pack for $3.99 just to get me up to that $75 mark. So after the four Pantene, the General Mills, the Kellogg's, the Safeway, the Arrowhead, that brings me to $75.56. After I subtract $16 in coupons, okay, that'll bring me to $59.56. I'll get the $10 Catalina from Spend 75, Get 10. I'll get the $5 Catalina from Buy $10 worth of frozen food, get the $5 back. And when I submit my General Mills rebate, I should get back about $35. Submit the Procter & Gamble beauty rebate, I should get back $15. Submit the Kellogg's rebate, and I should get back a $10 gas card. I might not be able to submit that all right now, 
but that will count against my total and it'll actually make it about a $14 money maker. Isn't that awesome? So make sure you check out your sales ad for Safeway this week. Make sure you're checking out your rebate forms. Check out Food and Fashion Sense for details on the Pantene available at Rite Aid, okay? And make sure that you print out these rebate forms. I'll attempt to find all the links and put them in the description box for you. Um, and I'll also put down a list of what my transaction will be for this spend 75 get 10. Hopefully everything works out great and I get all of those um, Catalinas printed out so that I don't have to go toe to toe at the customer service desk. All right. So thanks guys very much for watching. I hope that this was helpful. Hopefully some of you still have some of these rebate forms. I don't know what I've been waiting on, but this seems like a great time to use it. Everybody have a great day or a great evening. I'm about to start dinner. Happy couponing.